Hey tribe, what is the vibe? Welcome back to As I Am Tarot. I'm Kay, and I'm here to do a reading for the collective. Okie dokie. Holy Spirit, I ask that you give me clear, concise, accurate messages for the collective. Archangel Michael, I ask that you protect me from anything that is not of the holiest white light. Anything that is not of the holiest white light, please do not allow it to come in. In Jesus' holy name we pray, amen. Okay, so, first, I want to do this really quickly, because I got a lot of stuff to do today, but, um, I want to see what's going on with these energies. Holy Spirit, what is going on with the collective? I want to get some expression cards. took that one because it was the one that fell first okay let's see what else the happiest <laughs> ah. guilty jealous and what is this hateful okay so Somebody that's out here depressed, okay? <clears throat> Pissed the F off. And you could be happy about something that's going down. But, yeah, I feel like... Um, Let me get my life together, guys. Okay. Now. <clears throat> so. Somebody is depressed. Pissed the F off. Okay. Mm, let me see. What? cards have to say because I just have a feeling what else Go to the doctor now. So somebody could probably need to go to the doctor if you've been feeling like something is wrong. You know? We have new money alert that came out. Okay. Anything else? So, um, some of you could have some new money coming in, some new finances coming your way just do it so um if you've been thinking about doing something but you've been going back and forth with it the advice is to just do it like nike okay all right let's i want to pull some kipper cards and see who is this person 
that is depressed and pissed off and feeling guilty, jealous and hateful. Somebody having thoughts. Yeah. So. Let's see what else. I feel like. There's a man that's thinking about a woman. But I'm not feeling like. I mean it could very well possibly be. A man thinking about a woman like that. Okay. Take it how it resonates. journey so somebody could be thinking about moving but um yeah it could very well be a man that is thinking about a woman uh, a man who could be pissed off guilty jealous depressed this is giving me karmic vibes but you know i'm not trying to make this a karmic reading but i cannot control how it goes so, we're just going to go with the flow. <laughs> All right. We're going to get into tarot and see what else we can find about what is going on right now. Okie dokie, Akachoki. All right. Holy Spirit, tell us more about this person and this depressed energy. This pissed off energy. Who's guilty? Knight of Pentacles. So, yeah. Um, it could be somebody who was taking their time to make an offer, right? Hmm. Yeah, this person could be sending you messages like crazy. If not yet, you're probably about to start getting a bunch of messages. Okay. Uh, this person could have been juggling you. Um, but this just do it, I feel like. Um, this person is wanting to reach out, but they're like, They either wanted to reach out or they're wanting to come towards you. This person could be living um, in another state or another country, you know. But um, I feel like they're getting themselves in the mindset of coming, okay, towards you. Would this go to the doctor now? Um, some of you could feel like, uh, this person may have been all over the place. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? So you might just feel like you need to go to the doctor. Okay. Take our residence. Okay, we have the Knight of Swords that came out with the Four of Cups. 
All right. So, I feel like, yeah, <laughs> this person, you could be, you could have rejected this person. You could have cut this person off. And now this person is like, yeah, somebody's coming. Somebody's coming. This could be um a, a female as well, okay? I'm just, we're just working with the energies right now. But, with the two knights coming out, I feel like this person is just, this person is, I don't know. I just feel like this person does not fulfill every need that you have, okay? That's the best way for me to say it. And you know what those needs are that you're not getting fulfilled. Okay. Um, some of you may have been feeling rejected by this person. Knight of Wands. Goodness gracious. Yep. The Ace of Swords. So, Yeah. I feel like this person is definitely a player. This person just be doing the most, okay? And I feel like you know this. Like, you have... <coughs> excuse me. You have realized... You come to the realization that this is who this person is. You may have grown up with this person, with the Six of Cups. You may have known this person for a very long time. Which is probably why you had probably had a certain idea of who this person was in your mind. And now you know. You know? What else? We have the Emperor, the Four of Pentacles, the Nine of Swords, and the Ten of Cups. Okay. So what I'm getting here is like, this person is not trying to let you go. I feel like something may have happened here. That is on this person's mind with this nine of swords. Um, yeah, I feel like this person is having sleepless nights. <sighs> but I feel like Okay, this person wants to have a Ten of Cups with you, right? But I feel like with this Emperor, the, the chess piece is sticking out to me, which is making me feel like this person likes to play games, right? But at the same time, they're not trying to let you go anywhere, okay? And I feel like this person, uh, if they think about you being with someone else in like a ton of cups situation they have a problem just even thinking about that and that for some of you this person I feel like there's some kind of guilt okay I feel like this person has some kind of guilt about Something that had to do with your um, foundation. Like something that had to do with the harmony of your relationship. I feel like... Okay. <laughs> okay, let's keep going. Thank you. 
it. Okay. So how that the seven of wands in reverse, okay? So I feel like I don't know if this person is feeling defeated. Yeah, we have the Seven of Swords at the bottom. So, I don't know if this person is feeling defeated because of whatever, whatever has them in this Nine of Swords energy. It's almost like they tried to get away with something but it didn't work. I'm also picking up on some type of... Um, backfiring energy. Okay. <laughs> I'm picking up a whole nother story right now. I feel like there's someone thinking about going towards someone that they have been slowly giving an offer to. There may be messages going back and forth. Um, I feel like someone was rejected after being in a kind of situation that the both parties were not thinking about what they were doing. They didn't think before they, they acted with that Knight of Wands energy. Um, and they thought they knew what the hell they were doing. They thought they knew what would be the outcome, basically. Uh, and with this Emperor, I feel like somebody was looking at someone in the energy of um, someone that would be, th that would take control of the things that they couldn't, and they were not trying to let this person go. And now they're in the Nine of Swords energy, thinking about the future that they thought they were going to have, because everything backfired. Yeah. They didn't get away with whatever they thought they were going to get away with. What else? We have death and strength. Yeah. I feel like... Uh, this... Somebody is... is Okay, so this person, whoever this emperor energy is that was in this Knight of Wands energy, this person put an end to this cycle, which is why this person is sitting over here in Nine of Swords energy. This person put an end to the cycle, and now they're, with the strength card coming out, it's like they're not even looking, they're, they're not weak to whatever the situation was. So, okay, if, if they had a situation where, like I said, with the Knight of Wands energy, where they, they did things before thinking, or they did things without thinking. If you look, this person here, this lady on this Four of Pentacles is giving me, like, witchy vibes. Okay, so I'm just feeling like this person, everything backfired. The person that this person considers as the emperor put an end to everything and is now holding their ground. Okay, that's where the strength card comes in. We have the nine of wands and we have the six of swords that came out together yeah so this person after realizing 
maybe the type of individual they were dealing with is now hmm. I have a feeling okay if this is your person this emperor this person got way more than they bargained for okay this could have been a third party situation I know the card is not out here but this is, I'm just, I'm intuitive, so I'm just picking up on the energies, okay? I feel like this person did not, this person barked up the wrong tree. They didn't know what they were getting themselves into with this, yeah. This Knight of Wands energy. They got the clarification, okay? Now, they're in the Nine of Wands energy, the wounded warrior okay because like i said they didn't know they probably didn't even know this person did voodoo hoodoo voodoo whatever okay they probably had no clue but this is the thing like you know this is why you gotta think before you act because then you you know and now this person could be trying to bring um the situation back to balance with you with the six of swords okay <coughs> i feel like the person that they are leaving in the dust who everything backfired on this person who's in the nine of swords energy is the person that is um hateful and jealous or it could be your person and this person probably um, had other people on the side. Oh, no. Yeah, the star. Someone is trying to heal now. What else? Someone is trying to heal. like this person was not trying to let your person go okay but your person was it, it was only you on their mind which is making me feel like there's definitely been some kind of black magic yeah three pentacles some kind of um yeah this person wants to work with you this person wants, you know, they want to um, manifest with you. Okay, we have the Queen of Pentacles that came out in the reverse. So... I'm feeling like this could very well be this person who's in the Nine of Swords energy, okay? This person that's depressed and hateful. I feel like this person is depressed and hateful because your person did not want nothing to do with them. Like, you cannot force people to love you, you know? Why would you even want to force somebody to love you? Like, like make it make sense. Why would I want to force something that's so pure like that that is it like mm, 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 mm. anyway with this queen of pentacles in reverse somebody is um struggling okay she is overwhelmed or he take it how it resonates okay this person feels like they're worthless yeah the world and the four of wands so some cycle was put to an end, okay, because this person wanted commitment. This person wanted commitment with his, um, or his or her twin flame, okay? So they put an end to that whole situation. 
Yeah, yeah. <sighs> what else? We have the Nine of Cups and the Queen of Cups. Yeah. So this person is looking at this Queen of Cups as wish fulfillment. Whoever, whoever is in that Nine of Swords energy, knows about you. Okay? They probably knew about you before they even got together. And, and if you are indeed Twin Flames... This is why everything is backfiring because it's a divine connection and people don't get it. Yeah, we have the Ace of Cups with the Fool. Okay. So, I feel like this person may have, may not have been very emotionally mature, right, in the past. And I feel like with this Ace of Cups coming out with the Fool, I feel like after whatever they dealt with in that situation with that individual, they are now wanting to take a leap of faith and actually offer you love, okay? Real, true, genuine, a real, true, genuine commitment, okay? Okay. <clears throat> Yeah, because I feel like this person sees you, this person is attracted to you. This person is, you know, <laughs> they're, 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 um, you have a, some, a, something about you that just, you know, is, um, it, it magnetizes this person. What else? Three of Wands. Yeah, somebody, it could be this person waiting for something to happen before they come towards you. I don't know what you're waiting for. Then we have the Magician. Hmm. So this person could be trying to manifest um Manifest you. Because you probably, like, the rejection card came out. You probably rejected them. And you probably, you know. This could also be uh, this person in this Nine of Swords energy that... <laughs> That puts some stuff up and is waiting for it to come to happen to work. But with the seven of ones in the reverse, I don't think it's um it's gonna happen. Everything already backfired. This is why you can't this is why you can't you can't do can't do witchcraft and whatever on everybody you just can't ten of wands coming out with the wheel yeah so uh somebody has good karma on their side but this i okay Let me bring it in. Whoever this magician is, who is also the person in the Nine of Swords energy, who is also this Queen of Pentacles in reverse, is having bad karma. Okay? This person is going through the most right now. They're going through it. Yeah, <laughs> with the tower at the bottom of the deck, this person is going through the most. Because like I just said, you can't play with everybody, okay? I don't care who you see on this on this plane, in this 3D realm that we live in, right? 
Because you never know who these people have in the spirit realm. The hangman, yeah. Now, this person is stuck because it's up and it's stuck. <laughs> it's up and it's stuck. Okay? Period. You can't, justice at the bottom of the deck, you can't do everything to everybody. I don't care how many times you did it before and how many times you thought you got away with it. Okay? You're going to meet that right one. <laughs> okay? You're going to meet the right one. Don't say I didn't tell you. Some people, you know, they just got to go through stuff to understand. Some people have a God complex that they think they, 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 they all powerful. You know what I'm saying? Some people forget that they're just humans. And you walk around thinking and acting like you God. You can't be, you can't be all in this nine of swords. You can't be in that energy. God is never in nine of swords energy. Okay. Seven of Pentacles. So, this person is definitely sitting here looking at everything that they did, okay? And waiting for things to happen, but it's not. <laughs> it's not. It's not. We got the eight of um, cups at the bottom of the deck. They just need to walk away. Walk away. Yeah. All right, guys, I'm gonna leave it here. Okay, uh, yeah. If anything resonated with you in this um, reading, please like, share, and subscribe to the channel. It helps me get in contact and touch with your energy for future readings, and I will really appreciate it on top of that. So, I will talk to you guys in the next one. Love you. Later.